Hey guys, it's Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing a huge Target try on haul. So if you're interested in that, keep watching. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. All right, let's get into it. I have been loving being a little bit more casual and not doing like the sit down at my vanity for the intro and outro. So I'm sitting on the floor in my closet filming room. Uh, for reference, I am 5'7". I'm a true medium on the top, a 6 on the bottoms. That is the size I got. I think in everything, I will double check before I try everything on just so that you guys can know what size. I'll let you know how it fits. I will link it all down below. This is... It's all tops. It's almost all sweaters. Um, but yeah, I will link all of it, including my jewelry, my jeans, any shoes that I'm wearing. All the things will be in the description box for you below. The texture of this sweater is so good. Um, I'm wearing it with my sneaker wedges. I love these. They're neutral. They're super comfortable. You can walk around all day in them. They fit true to size. They're so good. Same with these jeans. I have a six in them. They're high rise. They're the best. And then this sweater, I have a medium. Um, the texture of it is just really pretty. And this came in a bunch of colors. So if pink is not up your alley, not to worry. There's something for you. Um, it has just the roll sleeve detail. And then the neckline has kind of a thicker. And then the bottom. I just wanted to show you what it looks like front tucked. So this is it. And then obviously you can wear it out. It has that same roll hem at the bottom. And then it's just kind of like a straight sweater. It's not longer in the back. It's just straight across. So you could totally wear it out like this. It's not going to be long enough for leggings, but it's not cropped either. As you can see, it goes all the way um, down, like three quarters of the way down my zipper. So it's definitely um, not a cropped. It's just like a plain regular classic sweater the sleeves are just a straight sleeve and they hit at a good spot um, I would definitely front tuck this I like that it's not too long that you have so much fabric that you can't tuck it so this is one of those really nice warm sweaters that I know I will wear all the time and it is not one bit itchy I do not deal with itchy clothes I kept on the same jeans and sneaker wedges this cardigan reminds me of one that was on sale during the Nordstrom anniversary sale this weekend, or not this, wow, not this weekend, <laughs> earlier this summer, um, with the color blocking. And I think that these colors are so beautiful for fall. One of the things that I love so much about these colors in particular are it's cream, the marled gray, and then this chocolatey rust brown color is that you can wear so many different colors with it, especially for your accessories. A lot of times if you wear like one color, you kind of get pigeonholed into the accessories that look good with it. But with this, I think that you could go in a lot of different directions, which is really nice. Um, so it's again, a medium. The sleeves are a nice length. It does have pockets. It doesn't have buttons or a zipper or anything to close it. And I'm 5'7", so it hits about... I don't know, three or four inches above my knee. There's no hood or anything. It's a soft material and there is like enough room to cozy up in it if you want to. So absolutely love the colors of this. I paired it with a hat because what's more fall than a nice hat? And let me give you a close up of the colors. So that's the rusty brown, the marled gray, and then the creamy beige. I almost forgot to mention that this is pretty lightweight, so I think that since it's a tight knit, it will keep you warm if you live somewhere cold like I do, but it's also lightweight, so it's not gonna be like the hottest thing in your closet if you live somewhere warmer or just here. A lot of times in the winter, I feel like a broken record, but I hate getting all bundled up when it's snowing outside and then you walk in somewhere and it's regular temperature and you're immediately sweating. So this is one of those that's lightweight enough. I just have a tank top on with it that you could easily wear it in the winter and stay warm. These pointed toed booties are the best. I've gotten so much use out of them already and it is just now starting to be fall. So cannot recommend them enough. Definitely worth every single penny. And if you are in the market for a thick sweater to wear if you live somewhere cold, this is it. And this is such a chunky warm sweater. This reminds me of like holiday photos or like a holiday party. I actually kind of want to wear this. I want to send out Christmas cards with Adam. I think this would be such a pretty sweater to wear with like a nice berry lip. Mm -hmm. 
So if you see me in a Christmas card this year in the sweater, you'll know why. Uh, anyway, it is nice and chunky. The sleeves have a bit of a balloon, but then they kind of taper in which you guys know, I love that. I love the detailing on the sleeves and then how it's different, it's that cable knit. On the front, it's got the little dots on it and it's almost like a mock neck, but not quite. It's like between a crew and a mock. It doesn't go up quite as high as a normal mock, but the um, collar is pretty thick. I mean, the whole sweater is really thick. So this is the material. Definitely a chunky sweater. And then I do have it front tucked, but you could of course, untuck it and it is just straight across the back is the same knit as the sleeves like the more plain knit and then just the front is that cable knit so this comes in a few different colors it's soft it doesn't choke you I'm actually sweating in this right now because it's not quite cold enough for this if you live somewhere that doesn't get cold this is not the sweater for you but if you live somewhere that it snows this is going to be such a good one. When I saw this top in the store, I assumed it was not going to look the best on me and I don't think it's super flattering on me, but I always want to be a resource for you guys. So just because it didn't work for me doesn't mean that it couldn't work for you. I have love handles. I carry my weight in my love handles. No matter how skinny I get, your girl's got love handles. So um, I think this would be way cuter if, it, if I went in a little bit more here. Um, than I do, but I personally don't. So this is sitting, this band goes all the way around. Hopefully you can see that. Um, and it's sitting right above my pants. I can pull it up so that it hits more at my natural waistline, but then it's pretty short on me and I don't think that's flattering either. So I will be returning this top, but if you have, um, don't have love handles, this would be the cutest top, the sleeves have that same cinching in them and it came in a bunch of colors. This color is just beautiful. Like I wish this could work for me. This would be such a cute top to wear to the office if you work in an office and yeah, I, I really like it. I just don't think that it works for my body type. So I just wanted to be a resource and show you guys even though it didn't work out for me. And this top came in a few colors too, but this like mocha color is gorgeous. The fabric is kind of like velvety fabric and it's ribbed and then the front of it comes down kind of in like a chevron pattern. Hopefully you can see that. Yeah, there we go. So you can see it kind of makes a V with the seam all the way down the front. It does have a straight sleeves but the sleeves are dolman so you can see and there's not a seam anywhere down the sleeve. It's down the middle of the sleeve and down the middle of the top. So I think that this would be really, really pretty with a faux leather skirt. I don't have one or I would put it on for you guys. This is one of those tops that I think could be dressed up and worn to the office or to like happy hour or something like that, but is also a comfortable like run errands in it kind of a top. Um, I obviously had it front tucked, but it is straight across and it is, you can see it kind of goes down to a V. So it tapers in, whoop, it tapers in at the bottom. So there's not as much room down here as there is up here, but there is still plenty of room. I have the medium and I feel like it's definitely still roomy. Honestly, I should have ended the try on haul in this outfit so that I could stay in it because it is so comfy. These sneakers, they are flat form sneakers. I I'm obsessed with them. They are just so good. I love that they're neutral. They go with everything. They fit true to size. They're just great sneakers. Um, and you know I can't say no to stripes. So it is no surprise that I grabbed this striped tee uh, at Target. Um, so this is very lightweight. It's just a really lightweight tee. I love this color. It's like a beigey peachy color. And I actually size up to a large in this just because I was holding it up. And this is the kind of tee that I want room in. So this is what it looks like untucked. I definitely could have gone with the medium, but I just, you know, I wanted some extra room. I just think this is going to be one of those like lounge around the house kind of tees. It's um, straight all the way around. And I knew that it would be slightly shorter than some of my other tees, but it's great for tucking in if you want to, especially because it is so lightweight. So it just kind of flows wherever. Uh, yeah, obsessed with this. I, I will definitely wear this way more than I should ever admit. And then I have my tiger's hat on. This is my 
This is like my dirty hair day running errands outfit. I am wearing the same boots, but I switched out to my non-distressed jeans and this blouse I just thought screamed workwear and I just think it is so beautiful. Um, I would totally wear this again for like a holiday with family or something like that. I love the sleeve detail. It cinches in um, everything about this. I just love. So the top has the prettiest like a diamond pattern with this tiny little baby ruffle and then the actual fabric has this pattern which is so so pretty so that is what the fabric is like on the entire blouse and this again it came in a few different colors this ivory creamy color is just such a good basic that you can wear with a million things i have my crossbody bag and this is one of those tops i obviously have it tucked in you can wear this with a skirt you could wear it with slacks you could wear it to the office or to dinner like there are so many different ways that you could wear a top like this i think it would be so pretty with a fall skirt and i think it would be equally as gorgeous with you know like something for the office and even a blazer over it because the neck detailing is so pretty that I just couldn't say no to this. I think that it is so beautiful and I need somewhere to wear it ASAP because I don't work in an office. Also, as far as sizing, I do have the medium and there's a lot of room in here. So I probably could have sized down um, just so that you guys can kind of see the bottom. Obviously on my hips, my hips are bigger than my waist is. So at the bottom, at the lowest point, I still have room. But up here, I have like a lot of room so um, I probably could have sized down I do like where the sleeves hit in the medium though and yeah that's kind of where I fall with that this chenille cardigan the color is just beautiful I kept my boots on and my jeans on because I didn't feel like changing again um, and then I have just this swing tank which I can link it below I have it in a bunch of colors and this cardigan is pretty thick um, I just kind of threw it off one shoulder but obviously you can wear it on both shoulders. So the sleeves are a decent length. It does come in other colors too. There's no pockets or buttons or zippers or literally anything. It's just a plain knit tank or cardigan, definitely not a tank. Um, it's the same length in the front and in the back. It's just a really good like basic cardigan and it has the knit detailing here and it kind of fades out and goes to a straight knit towards the bottom. But again, this is one of those pieces that I'm like starting to sweat in because it's chunky and warm and really good if you live somewhere colder or if you wait until it actually gets a little bit colder. These sneakers and leggings I've worn a million times. Both of them are so good. I highly recommend them. I've had both for a really long time. And then this sweatshirt. <laughs> I was looking at the colors in the store. I decided to go with the black because I don't have a lot of black in my wardrobe. Got home, tried it on, and now I realize why I don't have a lot of black in my wardrobe. I just feel like black is not that flattering on me. So, um, yeah. Anyway, it comes in a bunch of colors. It comes in a really pretty, like, minty, sea foamy light color. It comes in a cream ivory. I just felt like I have too many ivory colored sweatshirts which maybe I do, but that's just what I wear the most. So anyway, I love the cut of this sweatshirt and I guess that's what's important. The cut of this sweatshirt is really cute. It's hard to show details of black clothing just because it is so dark, obviously, but it has a thick ribbing right here along the collar. And then it has the same on the sleeve and it has that same on the bottom. Um, it is kind of like a swing style. So hopefully you can get a good idea of that. It's a little bit dark in here because the coloring is weird. But yeah, I think that this would be a really good sweatshirt to um, like lounge in or something. But I wear black a lot when I work out. So I would probably work out in this. I might actually just exchange it for a different color because I don't know that I'll get as much use out of it being black as I would in a different color, but it's super warm. It's incredibly fuzzy and soft on the inside. The sleeves are a good length. I love everything about it, but I think I might swap it out for a different color. Alrighty guys, that is everything that I recently picked up from Target. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.
Thank <laughs> you.